Hey Canberra, Sarah here from Luton Properties. Today's video, we're looking at the importance of online reviews of real estate agents when you're make, making the choice of which agent to go with. Now, a lot has changed in the digital landscape in the last decade. Um, previously, we used to come out and bring you a, a list or maybe some printed off reviews from our clients saying what a great experience they had. That process has now become a lot more transparent for you, which is fantastic. You're able to know that the reviews we get are verified that they're confirmed and that these are actually real people. Um, it wasn't someone's friend or family writing a great review about them. So let's have a look at where you can go out and interview your agents online. Now the biggest two sites at the moment are Rate My Agent, which has been around for a number of years, and now realestate.com, the portal, has also got into having client reviews on there as well. So this is a relatively new product from realestate.com.au, so when you're hopping online, you probably will see that the agents have a lot more reviews on Rate My Agent, um, but realestate.com is definitely going to pick up. Now the great things about these two sites, and why I suggest you go and look on those ones, is that the reviews are verified. As I said, so they have to confirm their email, their phone number, that you know these are their details so the agent can't go out and create um, you know a hundred great reviews about themselves these are real people and this has been their real experience now a couple of things to look out for when you're looking at reviews online you want to see for the agent how recent their reviews have been it's fantastic if an agent's got 50 reviews but if no one said anything about them in the last year then might you know this might be something that you want to look at second of all not every agent's going to have a perfect five star every time. The reason for this, sometimes there's slight little things where maybe the owner, you know, there was one or two things and they gave them a four and a half out of five. So don't be too concerned if the agent's got, on a say, um, rate my agent a 4.8. Um, at the end of the day, you want to make sure, you know, obviously they're, they're you know, above 4.8 or above is a good sign. Um, but if the agent's got, say, 50 reviews, at 4.8 compared to someone with 10 at 5, you know, you know they've got more experience and more people are willing to vouch for them. Secondly, not every property will have a review. This may not necessarily reflect anything that the agent's done. Sometimes our owners don't like to put their details in online. Sometimes our owners just don't have an online presence. And thirdly, sometimes as much as our owners love us, maybe send us flowers and thank you cards, they just forget to hop online. And you know, they get to a point where we don't, don't want to push them. So they're the things to look at when you're looking for those reviews online. Consistency, they have been getting regular reviews um, and, and the number of those ones compared to how many properties they've sold. Now, there are a couple other places that you can go and have a look at reviews. Of course, Google is a fantastic place, Facebook and also LinkedIn. So if you have any questions about this, um, anything happening in the market, how to search agents, please don't hesitate to give me a call. I'd love to have a chat and of course love to share some of those reviews that I've had from my clients. Have a fantastic day.